हाय गाइस आई एम विनय पांडे वी के पी मास्टर टीचर केमिस्ट्री इन वेदांतु एंड लेट अस सॉल्व क्वेश्चन नंबर एट ऑफ जे एडवांस ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी पेपर वन केमिस्ट्री एंड एंड दिस क्वेश्चन नंबर एट इज बेसिकली एम सी क्यू टाइप दैट इज मल्टी करेक्ट आंसर टाइप क्वेश्चन एंड दिस क्वेश्चन सेज विद रिस्पेक्ट टू द कंपाउंड वन टू फाइव चूज द करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट right these these are the compounds compound number 1 is here compound this is triphenyl methane this is benzene simple benzene this is methane this is cyclopentadiene and this is uh, acetylene or ethane right now you have to you have to find the correct statement statement one i mean out of four statement one or more than one may be correct so statement a says the acidity of compound 1 is due to the delocalization in the conjugate base statement b says the conjugate base of compound 4 is aromatic statement c says compound 2 becomes more acidic when it has a no2 substituent and and uh, last statement d is the acidity of the compound follows the order 1 2 1 greater than 4 greater than 5 greater than 2 greater than 3 so let us check one by one first statement is the acidity of compound is due to the delocalization in the conjugate base let us check what is the conjugate base of this compound this is trimethyl tri triphenyl i'm sorry triphenyl this is triphenyl uh, methane right so conjugate base of this triphenyl methane is conjugate base of this triphenyl methane is this one where you remove this h plus and you find that this c minus is having i mean negative charge of this carbon is delocalized on the three phenyl one by one because phenyls they are free to rotate so at a time of whole structure is not flat and planar but this negative charge of course is delocalized and resonance is stable that means negative charge is resonance is stable right and that means statement a is correct statement a says that acidity of the compound 1 is due to delocalization in the conjugate base conjugate base means you remove h after removing h you will get one anion that anion is the conjugate base conjugate acid base pairs differ by one h plus so if you remove one h plus you will get an anion that anion is the conjugate base and that conjugate base of course is resonance stabilized or delocalized delocalized means resonance stabilized so statement a is correct Conju uh, statement B: The conjugate base of compound four is aromatic. Let us check. Compound four is compound four is cyclopentadiene, and conjugate base of compound four is this anion, cyclopentadienyl anion. This cyclopentadienyl anion follows all the three conditions of aromaticity: total six pi electrons, right? So it is aromatic. That is correct. True. That means that means even statement b is correct right now statement c compound 2 becomes more acidic when it has a no2 substituent of course any any compound i mean no2 is an ewg it is called electron withdrawing group and in presence of electron withdrawing group in presence of in presence of electron withdrawing group acidic strength increases ka always increases so this statement is in general true that in presence of ewg acidic strength will increase for any compound which is acidic in nature so that's true even statement c is true now they say the acidity of the compounds follows the order 1 greater than 4 greater than 5 greater than 2 greater than 3 this is wrong because acidic strength of acidic strength uh, uh, of this this four number compound is highest because after after removing h plus it becomes aromatic the anion becomes aromatic so attainment of aromaticity is always you know always uh, increases the stability very drastically and that's why four must be highest i got uh, the data pk values for all these compounds so i brought these pk values for you this is pk a of this triphenyl methyl triphenyl methane is 33.33 right and pka of this benzene is 
and pKa of any alkane is in the range of 50 any alkane if there are many organic compounds written and you have you are asked to uh, mention the least acidic compound then kindly mention alkane alkanes are the least acidic uh, compounds organic compounds right pKa value of cyclopentadiene is nearly 16 which is equal to the pKa value of ethanol pKa value of ethanol pKa value of ethanol and pKa value of uh, what you call cyclopentadiene are equal nearly equal and they are 60 16 pKa value of acetylene is 25 acetylene is 25 and you know less the pKa more is the acidic strength so according to this pKa value data if you want to if you want to uh, make the order of acidic strength order of acidic strength then actual correct order of acidic strength should be 4 most acidic then fifth one which is second most acidic out of the given list then it is first then it is second and at last third of course so this should be the actual acidic strength order that means our statement uh, D is not the correct statement. So our answer for this question must be A, B and C. They are the correct statements. Okay. Got this point guys?